Alrighty, so this is actually an implementation that I was surprised we hadn't done already. I had to dig back and make sure that this wasn't a duplicate because it is something we've done for people a handful of times. Um, so this implementation is around migrating CRM attachments to WorkDrive. Um, and the use case for this is that, you know, when let's say we're spinning up CRM for a brand new client, they've never used it before. You know, almost every single time we're going to build them a little integration to WorkDrive where all their accounts and deals and contacts get their file structure. And then we standardize their workflow that that's where all the files go, right? Is use the links, drop them in WorkDrive, and you're good. Um, but, you know, we also engage with people who have been using Zoho for a long time and we show them WorkDrive. They say, wow, this is way better than how I'm managing files right now. We take a look in their CRM and, you know, they've got a deal that has five attachments on it, you know, and every single PDF and Word doc is just being loaded directly into that CRM attachments related list, which is fine in the short term. But in the long term, the problem is that one, none of those documents are cloud based, right? So if you open up a Word document that's linked to a deal and make any edits, you're going to have to re upload it to the deal and remove the old one as a mode of kind of like version control. Um, and then the other element is that the storage inside of CRM, if you do hit the limit, it's not a very good deal to increase it, especially not versus how much storage you get natively out of WorkDrive. Um, but the problem is there's not like an easy way to just click a button in Zoho and say, move all my files to WorkDrive. Um, so what we do here is we set up a little scheduled function that basically looks at records in certain criteria. Um, in this case, it was, um, they really only had attachments that they cared about in the deals record in certain stages. So like from closed one on through their fulfillment, there are a bunch of documents that they wanted to make sure that they kept. Um, and so we'll build a little scheduled function that basically loops through those records and moves their attachments into the relevant folder in WorkDrive. I want to highlight just a couple things with this. So if you're working with really, really big files, this becomes a lot more complicated because Deluge does have some limits in terms of how many files they can kind of manage at a given time and take through their process. I think, and if anyone tells me I'm wrong, it's about five megabytes. So for most like contracts and things like that, you're going to be fine. If you're storing 4K video, not so much. Um, and then I'll also highlight that depending on how many records you have in the system, this can take a little while to finish up. Right. So we can't run it because of some of those file limitations. We can't run it on like a thousand records in a go. You know, we kind of have to take it, you know, like 50 an hour or 100 an hour. Right. And kind of like run through them sequentially. Um, but it is one of those things where you build it, set it and forget it. And then about you know a week or two later, all your files have been moved over. And then going forward, you would just load them directly into WorkDrive. Um, so big shout out to JP. He's probably probably done this function or versions of it a few times, but this is one that was on our list for this week that I wanted to get out there because, you know, I think a lot of people start with Zoho with, you know, CRM and campaigns and desk and projects. And then eventually you're on Zoho one, you realize that work drive exists and you go, wow, that's way better than CRM attachments. Um, but it can be really sticky, right? Cause you've already got all these files in CRM. And the prospect of going deal by deal and manually moving them over is just, it can be kind of insurmountable. This would be nice. I don't know if it's, we're doing all this internal in Zoho, but one of the most difficult things when you're doing a migration from salesforce.com is getting those attachments over, right? And I know Salesforce has an API. It'd be interesting to see if we could take this, tweak it almost as an app that would go in get the attachments for each and then and create that folder structure prior to the migration. Cause in most cases we, it's just the, the juice is not worth the squeeze in migrating attachments. It's kind of like just do it manually. Cause the process see, Salesforce gives you these huge 500 megabyte files with attachments and the attachments are just numbers and you got it. There's all kinds of things you got to do to, to set it up. Anyway, nice job, JP. Excellent.